Kieran, welcome yes. to Dartford. Cheers. You must be delighted to, to yeah. sign. Yeah, um, I've been talking to Steve for a little while, so it's good to get over the line. Yeah, I mean, you've got fantastic experience with, you've been at Boreham Wood last year in, in the division above. Yeah. I mean, that's going to be vital to, this, to this start for side, isn't it? Yeah, hopefully. Um, I'm here to try and get them up, so um, hopefully my experience can count and we can push to the top. Yeah, for any fans that haven't, haven't seen you play before, what, what type of player would you say you are? Um, I'm a midfielder, ball, ball based midfielder. I like to go on the ball, I like to use the ball. Um, exciting, hopefully, and hope they enjoy watching me play. Yeah, obviously, um, with, the, with the squad that's being put together, you, you, you probably have seen. Yeah. I mean, how, how excited are you? To yeah. the other, uh, um, I know a couple of names that I would know already, so it should, be a, it should be a good season. Hopefully, we can get the ball rolling and get on a good run and see where it takes us. Yeah, I mean, the first time the Dark fans are going to see you in action is, is pre season. Yeah. Uh, I mean, the fixtures that we've got in pre season are. A strong opponents. Yeah. How excited are, are you to be playing against them? Yeah, as well? well, you want to challenge yourself, especially in pre-season. You want to be playing people that you ex or expect to win, and um, challenge yourself fitness-wise and ball-based-wise, and see where you, where you're at. And obviously, in pre-season, we fully expect the well, the fans to be back here at Princess Park. You, you played at Boreham Wood last year without any fans. Yeah. How nice is it going to be to have the fans back in here? Yeah, well, we had the fans in the last game, and just the noise around the ground, you can, it just makes you feel better. Like it's not, you can't hear every single word everyone's saying. There's a bit more, a bit of background noise. It's much more better. Yeah, yeah, like like you just said there about like you, you can't hear everybody and things like that, and it may may or may not influence referee decisions and, yeah. and things like that. But it's. It makes it makes such a difference to, to our fans back in, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, well, obviously. You know, we play football; it's an entertainment at the end of the day. We love playing, and we love playing in front of people. So when you take the fans away, it seems pretty aimless to an extent. Obviously, you're still playing for three points, and you want to get three points, but the fans make a big difference. Playing here, obviously. Um, yeah. I, I mean, yeah, you've, you've been out here today. What, what, what do you think of the place? I've played here once. And I think uh, once or twice actually, maybe back a few years ago. And I came and watched actually. Born would play here. In, I was suspended for the game in uh, I think the FA Trophy maybe. So yeah, I, I think the ground's great. Obviously, the fans having the fans back in here would be great, and I'm raring to get going. And obviously, a few, uh, right about a month ago, Steve obviously signed a three-year deal himself to be manager here. Was that kind of part of the? The reason behind it was that yeah. the long term security of him. Obviously, well. I've, I've played with Steve, I played under Steve when he was at Macclesfield and I enjoyed my time there. And when he called me and told me about Dartford, I, straight away my ears perked up. I wanted to hear what he had to say. And him telling me that he's got a three year deal here and he wants to get into the conference is a massive part of why I'm here as well. I'm hopefully going to try and help the team push forward, push up the league. and get the promotion that they deserve. Perfect. Welcome to Dartford. Cheers. Cheers mate. Well done.